Process Analytical Technology, or PAT, is a regulatory framework that was initiated by the United States Food and Drug Administration in order to encourage innovation in product development, manufacturing, and quality assurance. The goal of Process Analytical Technology is to build quality in the biopharma production process through being able to monitor and control the process in real time. Through the identification of critical process parameters and critical quality attributes, and the maintenance of these CPPs and CQAs within a specified design space, one's able to compensate for variability in raw materials as well as equipment. Through doing this, quality can be built into the process and the product, supporting the quality by design principles, and not tested into the product at the conclusion of the process. There are four key steps to the implementation of a dynamic manufacturing process. First, one must monitor CPPs, critical process parameters, or, and critical quality attributes, CQAs, in an inline, online, or atline fashion using various sensors or analytical techniques. Then, the data generated by those sensors is analyzed so that one can control the CPPs and CQAs within a specified design space through inline or real-time process adjustments. In bioprocessing, PAT involves the use of chromatographic, spectroscopic, or mass spectrometric sensors, which are integrated into upstream or downstream unit operations in an inline, online, or atline fashion. This enables the process to be monitored and controlled in real time. Implementing a PAT strategy is really focused on reducing process variability. Through the integration of inline and online sensors, combined with modeling of CQAs, in conjunction with automated control of critical process parameters that affect various CQAs, you can ensure that process variability will be reduced. By reducing process variability, you can reduce the risk of releasing product that doesn't adhere to predefined quality standards into the marketplace. This shift is to push away from a traditional quality control approach, where quality is tested at the end of the process, to a true quality approach, where the process is continuously adjusted in order to ensure a guaranteed end product quality. This inline, real-time sensing really supports our overall holistic vision towards achieving the end goal, which is moving towards the facility of the future. Commonly employed spectroscopic techniques include Raman, mid-infrared, near-infrared, and UV-Vis. Some of the reasons spectroscopy is such a powerful tool in the PAT space is because of its fast response time, its ability to potentially reduce taking samples, and its ability to maintain sample integrity. Particularly for bioprocessing, Raman has become an attractive technology because of its high molecular specificity and weak water bands, which enable high quality analysis to take place in aqueous solution. Raman, therefore, has great potential for inline, real-time, in-situ measurements of critical quality attributes and critical process parameters. The Raman technology will be discussed more detail in a subsequent video. Mm -hmm.